today we are doing vodka pops. Sorry, vodka marshmallow pops, okay? <clears throat> By the way, just curious, is it marshmallow? Because that's an A, or marshmallow, which is an E. I don't know. Okay, so we grab our little marshmallow mellows, put them there. Okay, and now we grab our pop sticks. Okay, guys, you can find these on Amazon. All right, if you if you want to try this, because this is a cool treat for your guests, and it's really really simple. So you take a stick and you just insert it. Twist, twist, twist. Okay, put in my glass. This really simple but ultra cool. Okay. So you put them in there like that. So now we have our four marshmallow pops lined up. And then we get some vodka. Good old fashioned whipped cream vodka. These flavored vodkas getting harder and harder to find because they're not as popular as they were before. We'll okay. soak our marshmallows in some whipped cream vodka. Let them soak. Let the booze seep in. It's a delicious aroma of whipped cream, okay? You ever notice that? How come we don't have like perfume flavors like whipped cream, curry chicken, okay? KFC. I'm just saying, like I don't eat chicken right now, but when I drive by KFC, I go, that's a delicious smell. I can't have a little bit here. Now I come behind and this is just regular sugar. What you do is you just sprinkle this over. This is one of the easiest dessert treats ever. So we got our pink. Now we got our little blue here. I know a lot of comments you guys will go, why do y'all use so much sugar? Why? Because we, we like sugar. Yeah, I know sugar is bad, but we like it. We, a lot of our drinks fall into the dessert category. And we will get some purple in there. What's your favorite color, by the way? In the comments below, let us know your favorite color. And there you have it! Vodka Marshmallow Pops, live from the Tipsy Bartender Institute of Booze and Technology. Stay tipsy! Stay tipsy! <laughs>